What is up everybody? Welcome back. It is Dan's Plants again. It has been four months since I've actually done one of these, which is amazing that I'm doing one now. So, I got all the, or not all the plants, I got a couple plants I've actually changed. So, as you remember, the Star Cactus. We're just gonna get right into it, you know? Uh, no introduction, no nothing. If you haven't seen my plant tour, I would recommend going and watching that because that is where you are going to get the biggest idea of all these plants. So, yes, my hands are big. Also, yes, small this cactus is growing a large stem right here. Or, uh, it's, a, it's a little flower. So, the cactus has actually started to blossom a bit. So, it's growing little flowers right here, which is amazing because this has actually been limited in size for quite some time. And just now, it's starting to um, look really good. It was actually turning, um, if you haven't followed me on Twitter, uh, it's actually started to turn yellow, which was worrying to me. So I started keeping close track on it, finally got it back up to speed, and then bam, this started happening. I was like, whoa, this is a big, big, big rock coming out of this thing. And yeah, it's massive. It's long. I think it's like, uh, it's like seven. So it's like, yeah, 14 inches long or something like that, which, I mean, that's nice. It's a, it's a nice cactus too. Like, I like this cactus specifically. Uh, I mean, it doesn't look like it would be considered a cactus, but it is a cactus. It's a star cactus. But yeah, so that's a star cactus right there. Uh, I'm actually going to put this one back in the window because I don't really want to have the blossoms going everywhere. All right. Here is another, that is an update. So, this was my uh, bonsai tree, or I guess it was a type of bonsai tree. It's not the, uh, it's not like the original bonsai tree that you see in everyone's house. It's a generic one, as they would call it. This is I don't know the botanical name for it. It's starting to grow its leaves back. Um, I picked it up when it had them, and the leaves fell off. But then, I mean, the plant already wasn't doing too good when I picked it up, but. The leaves started falling off, and I was like, ooh, oh no. But with a little bit of rehabilitation and a little bit of a maneuvering around it, I mean, I took off a little bit of the branch and then put on little pieces of uh, little nutrient stuff. So I kind of like put that inside of this. And then bam, it is looking very healthy. Look at that. It's starting to grow its leaves back. It's got three already. I remember when I saw this thing had its leaves grown back, I was so happy, like so, so happy. And now it's getting its leaves back and I am extremely happy about it. So that is the unidentified name bonsai tree. I don't know the name for it. I want to get the name really bad. Once I get the name, I will definitely say it. But that is the next updated plant. We have one more that I'd like to show you all. So I'm going to put this back. All right, everyone, this is the final plant that we are going to look at today. This is my lucky bamboo. You may remember it from the last one. It looks, you know, it went through its little rehab. So there's a little story behind this one because uh, it had to go through its little reha rehabilitation. Yes, but you may be wondering what happened. So I'm going to tell you anyway. So what happened was the bamboo started to get a little yellow. Uh, and that happened because I started using fluoride in the water accidentally mad. It was tap water, but that going from me using distilled water and adding nutrients into it does not work well when you're going with tap water when you use it accidentally for the next week. So that was my mistake. Um, but after two months of rehabilitation, it's green again. It is doing very well. Uh, there's a little rope on the end here, but what I did was I ended up cutting off the yellow bits. So you can see right here, these are new leaves. These used to be uh, yellow. So I cut those off and then I kind of put in little, uh, kind of like uh, nutrient stuff to kind of just promote some growth for the leaves. Oops, sorry, I bumped into my microphone. So I used a little bit of stuff to promote the leaf growth and then 
it just looks a lot better now so it's more green it still does have a little bit of white along the uh corners and edges here but that's okay because uh soon it's gonna look a lot better so here we have the lucky bamboo let me get you a better shot of that looking a lot better than when it did before so i'm gonna go put this bad boy back and i will record an outro i guess we'll end off on a cute note so this is a little dude again he's doing fantastic so anyway that's gonna be it for today's uh video and i guess that is going to be it for the dan plants uh video for the month i want to do these monthly actually so i'm thinking every month i will do like some sort of plant update this one uh there wasn't really much going on so i didn't really have anything to record so it was just kind of like all right uh plant what's going on with you cool you had some sort of change all right get over here uh that's more of what it was like uh for this because it's been four months since i've recorded so it wasn't like anything was going on but i do want to do these every month or so so Maybe I'll see all of you in the next one if it gets in a month. Hopefully I can remain consistent with it. I believe I should. Uh, I will update you on the rehabilitation of the bamboo as that should be getting greener now. Anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you all enjoyed this. And if you are only here for the plants, I hope to see you next month. If you're here because of my channel, I hope to see you later. Goodbye, everyone, and I hope you have a fantastic day.